Good morning or afternoon or evening, whenever, whatever time you're watching this at. Friends and family and my other fellow YouTubers, I am going to be reviewing this website for this new, um, this new technology called an examen. Um, I was going through my Instagram one day and I ran into this ad for this and it looked weird at first so I just scrolled over it. And then I saw it a couple more times and I was like, maybe I'll look at this company. Maybe I'll look at this device that they're trying to sell me. I thought it was just this huge company like Apple or Samsung just trying to throw their stupid ads onto my Instagram. But when I clicked on their link, they didn't have too many pictures on their Instagram. And at that moment, I realized this cannot be a big company at all. If you don't have a lot of pictures on your Instagram or any social media, they've got to be a small company. So I emailed them and I was like, hey, um, I ran into, oh no, I clicked on their link on their Instagram page. They brought me to this page and I was like, hey, um, I ran into your, your ad on Instagram and... I really like the design. I like everything about your new product. And I was wondering if I could review that product for you. And they emailed me back saying that they weren't in production yet, but they'd be more than happy to work with me if I wrote up a plan and I sent it to them as well as if I reviewed their website for them. That I know of, I am the very first person to ever review this website. And I think I'm going to be the first person to ever review this product, which is amazing. I'm happy that I get to do this. I'm happy that I reached out to this company, even though they kept throwing their ad on my Instagram and it got really annoying. Um, so this, I believe the company is called Examen. It is introduced by a um, professional race car driver. This is the world's... First all-in-one tech essential responsibility made with recycled ocean plastic. So this guy isn't going out and grabbing, making more plastic to hurt the earth. He's taking plastic that people have already used, recycled it, and now he's making this great product out of it. As we scroll down, as you can see, they're still in like... Uh, a beta phase where you can claim this device um this I thought was pretty cool it has a fingerprint secure charging case it charges all these devices at once it has um five devices including that's not including the case but if you include the case there's six there's six devices all together for this device, you have Bluetooth tracker, which is, um, I believe the Bluetooth tracker is inside this case itself. Power bank, power bank 3000 mega, mega hours. Um, I have a power bank somewhere around here and I don't think that it is 3000 mega amps hours. I can't find it right now, so... Then you have wireless earbuds, which you'll see up here on the picture, right next to the um, the wireless charger port. You have a precision stylus pen, which is if you look inside the case, there's going to be a blue thing up there. That is going to be your stylus. That I saw in a later picture further down below, which you'll see. That looks amazing. And then you have a multifunctional 4-in-1 USB this I thought was pretty intelligent because most USBs are only meant for PCs or anything with a USB port. This is like, so this USB is mainly for transferring files from a phone to a phone, which I thought was genius. Yeah, you have um, a bunch of apps that you can download and transfer files. But it's going to be a lot easier to plug this device into your phone 
take whatever files you need, put it on this USB, take it out, put it back in a different phone, and transfer files. That is going to be a lot easier than going to the Google Store, going to the Apple Store, downloading an app, going to another phone, downloading that app too. But if you want to transfer something from an Apple to an Android, maybe the Apple has an app that the Android doesn't have. The Android has an app that the Apple has. Or maybe they have the same app, but for whatever reason, the files that are on an Android... I'm pretty sure this can happen are not compatible with Apple devices. For some reason, Apple devices probably won't be able to read an Android file. I don't know. But I really support this multifunctional 4 in USB. I cannot wait to get my hands on it and test it out. As I have several electronic devices I would love to test it out with and see how great it is. And then you have a 128 gigabyte USB flash drive. That I think is, I think that's awesome. 128 gigabyte USB is around $16. That's not a very cheap piece of equipment that they're putting into this device. Now, I don't know the base price of this product yet. I won't know it until they come into production and they actually start delivering it to people. So then we come down here to the software. This this I kind of understood. I understood it for the most part. I believe it's an Android OS. It's a performance OS. So it's going to be... It's going to be a little higher quality OS than you're going to get on your average like Galaxy S phone or your Apple phone. It has an antivirus. Now this I didn't fully understand. I'm Like I said, I'm still learning about this Volt thing. And I don't know if it like comes with antivirus for your phone or what exactly this antivirus is. I'm really hoping viruses cannot get into this vault, but we will see when it comes out and I can review it. It has a video and it has a photo and video extractor, which is really nice because I've downloaded some apps that don't deal with videos or mostly just videos because videos are usually too high quality. Because with the S, S8 Plus I have, I always try and record every video in the highest quality. Like this video, I'm recording in the highest quality that this screen recorder will record in. You have a file backup, which is really nice. Everybody wants to be able to back up their files. And then you have a Google Drive Connect, which is also pretty freaking amazing that they can do that. Which kind of hints me more towards that it's a Android product. So now to get down to the really fun part, the hardware. So the Volt itself is going to be compact and lightweight. Really cool thing is because of certain size devices, electronic devices, TSA won't approve it. But this guy went out of his way to test it through TSA or to talk to TSA and he got it approved. So now you can take this Volt on the planes, you can charge your devices with you. And you can take it anywhere you want. I think that's pretty freaking amazing. It has an intelligence display. So it'll tell you what the battery is at. I believe it'll tell you the time. Again, I'm not too sure. I don't have the product in front of me testing it out. So I don't know 100% about this device. I really honestly only know what this website is showing me. It has a location tracker, which is going to be the Bluetooth tracker inside the Volt. Now, I don't know if you can take that out and place it somewhere else. I'm sure you can if you take the device apart, which I wouldn't really, I wouldn't really support that, to be honest. But then you have, um, and then the coolest part of it is it's ocean recycled plastic, which I think is awesome. This guy is taking plastic that's already used, and he's just... He's remaking it. He's not putting more pollution into the world that we don't need. He's already taken the pollution we have and he's putting it to good use. So the Examine Volt holds all of your daily use technology and protects it with a fingerprint lock and Bluetooth tracker. It's designed by European race car driver and made of ocean recycled materials. The Volt is intuitive and easy to use. 
just plug and charge it to the wall and it will charge all your devices at once. If you put all your devices in this vault and this vault itself acts as a, a bigger size power, brim, power bank, but you have everything inside this power bank instead of having a bunch of wires and stuff. And that was another thing I wanted to get on. This is wireless. So it takes a wire to charge the volt, but the volt charges all this stuff wirelessly, which I think is awesome. It's less wires, less of a clutter that you have around you, and it just works so much better with your daily life. So the power bank as well is compact and lightweight, and it's TSA approved. That's awesome that he got everything inside this volt TSA approved. Again, this has intelligence display to tell you what your battery bank is on. That I absolutely love. Again, haven't seen it. I'm going to repeat that because I have not seen this product yet. But if this is what I think it's showing is that it has a numeric display for your battery. So it tells you what the percentage of the battery is. I personally hate battery chargers that are lit up with little lights and it's like oh yeah three lights charged you have all four lights charged like i don't know what that percentage is like i don't know what one percent like four four little dots is probably going to be a 25 percent battery charge because you take those four you split it up your times so four is a hundred common normal math divided into four you're gonna get 25 percent each one so, but I believe that the um, the numeric display will be really helpful. People will know like, oh, my battery charger is on 30%. I have to shove it in the vault and let it charge. Oh, it's on 20%. Not, oh, I have one dot left. I wonder how much time I have left. Like, how much time of that dot do I have left? That's what I was trying to get towards. Is you don't know how much power or how much time of that one dot you have left. For this power bank. So I think that's really cool. So the power bank is 30,000 mega hours. Oh, I thought it was 3,000. My bad. Can't read. It charges three de devices simultaneously. So if you look at this closely. I can't zoom in for whatever reason. So on the left and the right. The two big white things are going to be your regular USB. And in the middle. You have two type C's. Yeah. So yeah. The two USB. And type C, 60 watt and 100 watt. It's compatible with Apple, Android, and phones and MacBook Pro. So not even can this charge phones, this can charge a MacBook. This can charge a laptop. That is how great this power bank is. And again, I really cannot wait to get my hands on this and test this out for what it is. This sounds amazing. And then it's 18 watt USB QC 3.0 compatible. That, I'm not too sure what it is. I'm going to have to research that a little bit more. I've never seen that before. Then this is really, this is pretty freaking cool. I personally can't wear headphones, these type of headphones, due to the headphones being too big. But, I think it's really cool that um, it comes with headphones. So, you can just throw these headphones inside this vault. You can see what the charger is at. And when you know that they're fully charged, then you can just take them out and listen to music. Or if you're on a plane. Again, I believe this is very helpful if you're on like a plane or something. Because now you get to take this little vault. You can charge everything in this little vault. You can take the power bank out. Let's say your phone's dying a little bit. And you just take the power bank out of your vault. Put the vault back in your bag. Put the power bank on like your lap or something. And you charge your phone right there on the plane. And then you have your headphones. And you have some other devices all inside this vault. You don't need to go around in your bag looking for a stylus in this clutter. You don't need to look for your headphones in this clutter. You have all these things inside this vault, and I believe that is great for a device. So, with the headphones, again, these are Android and iOS compatible. It's high precision 1.5 millimeters, screen protective design. 
So screen protective design, I'm not 100% sure what that is. If you know what it is, that's great. Um, so it repeats Android and iOS compatible and high precision again. I'm not too sure why it repeats those, but it might just be a goof on the website, but I don't know. I got to get back after I make this video and show the lady and she'll talk to me a little bit more about it. So the wireless earbuds, now 60 hours of playtime, which is amazing. I don't think I know any other headphones that are 60 hours of playtime. The wireless earbuds I have right now, I think are like four or five hours of hour playtime. So that's, that's so much more. So it's designed with superior hi-fi sound and the world's most advanced true wireless earbuds. So they are saying that these headphones, that these earbuds are top of the line, one of the best earbuds out there on the market now. And again, I can't wait to test them out and see how good they really are. They are designed by the ex-Apple and Sennheiser sound engineers. So these headphones are designed by Apple and it looks like another company. I've never heard of Sennheiser. So again, that's another company I gotta go look up. It is made with the cutting edge cold Qualcomm semiconductor technology. Agronomic design, gold standard of music, your personal concert. So these headphones are gonna sound so great that they're saying that it's gonna sound like a concert. That is pretty high quality too, from what I know. Low latency Bluetooth, so low latency, if I remember correctly, is low lag. You're not gonna have a lag like other Bluetooth devices are gonna have. It's gonna be more clear and less things are gonna interrupt that Bluetooth signal. Intuitive touch sensors. There's a touch sensor, I believe, if I'm right. These are going to be... Um, you're going to touch it so many times to do certain things like... Pressing it once is going to turn the volume up. Or like holding it for three seconds is going to turn it on. Something like that. That's what my last wireless earbuds I had that did not have a wire seemed to have. Because I have Bluetooth headphones right, right now, but they have a wire connecting the headphones and they have a little device, and it's a lot easier to use that little device. As a powerful bass, seamless pairing, advanced noise counseling, canceling. I cannot talk today. Signal stability and awesome comfort levels. That Those honestly sound a lot better than most of the headphones I've seen in stores to be honest. Most of the headphones I see in stores are only like five to six hours of play time. They don't look as good. They're just really overhyped for what they are, but this these ones I believe are gonna be good. So then we go down to this, the Bluetooth tracker. So this is going to be a Bluetooth 5.0. Bluetooth 5.0, I have not heard of yet. I'm not very up to date with the um, 5.0 and stuff for the Bluetooth. It's camera remote control. Oh, that I'm not 100%. Again, I've really... This is just their beta website, I believe. I really got to talk to one of their salespersons. I got to see a little bit more about these. They could use a little bit more detail on this website about what they mean by camera remote control. Like, what are they meaning by that? Like, can this little device control your cameras in your house? Or, like, I don't know. It's, it's crazy. It's one touch ring and find. So that's really nice. You just press the button and it's going to be a lot easier to find it. I believe you can hook this Bluetooth tracker up to your phone. 
And that is how you press it on your phone. Your phone goes to find it and it's going to be a lot easier for that. As a separation alarm. So when you get so many feet away from this device, it's going to have an alarm. And that alarm is going to sound. And it's going to let you know, hey, you're leaving your device behind. And I, I think you can set this to do so many feet or like... Let's say you're like, you have headphones in your pocket. Let's say you leave the device and your headphones in your pocket and you have like a special sound that goes off. Like, hey, your headphones are out. That would be cool. That, I'm not 100% sure what you can do with that separation alarm if you can customize it or not. So, place inside the vault, the examine guide will alert you when you leave your tech behind. You can also attach it to any object or pet. So you can find them via the examine app. Simply ring a missing item around the house or be notified before leaving things behind. So that's cool. You can take this device out of the vault and you can put it on like your dog. Hell, if... Well, it's only 150 and 450 foot range. So... I don't know, maybe if you lose things really easily, this device will be great for you. If you live out in like the woods or stuff, this would be great to like put on your dog, your pet or something. So then you can just ring and you're making sure that like your animal is safe. As a range of 150 feet indoor and 450 feet outdoor. As a last seen location. So I believe when you look this up in your phone... It tells you where that device was last seen. As a 100 dB alarm, crowd GPS com cap compatible, 18 months replaceable battery. So I'm assuming this battery can last for 18 months. That I'm going to have to, again, research more. They... I do got to say they got to go a little bit more in depth about the specs. A little bit more depth. Just a little bit more info on each spec. That would help be very helpful. Worldwide usage so you can use it anywhere around the world. No monthly fees or expensive SIM cards needed. So what they mean by that is most tracking devices that I know of have a monthly fee and then you have to put a SIM card in it because it saves all the data from that tracker to the SIM card. So then you can take that SIM card out. Let's say you're tracking like, let's say this tracker could go like 50 miles. Let's say you put this tracker in like your phone for like your daughter or something or like your kid or like you just want to track somebody's phone. You can now take that SIM card out and you can see where they went to see if they were like lying to you or something or they're going where you know they weren't supposed to be going. So I believe that's what they mean by no monthly fees or expensive SIM cards needed. This, okay, so I, I'm going to be honest. This looks like my favorite part because it's blue, it's shiny, it really it kind of shoots out more than everything else. And it's an active stylus. It's Android and Apple compatible, high precision 1.5 millimeter, and screen protective design. So the screen protective design, this one makes a little bit more sense. As in the tip for it is going to be designed in a special way to where it's not going to hurt the screen. So that is really nice. So examine stylus is how drawing and taking notes should be precise and intuitive. Ready to use with any touchscreen device and charges wirelessly in the examined vault as we knew because everything that comes with this vault charges in the vault. Again, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep saying that that is awesome that you can charge everything in this one vault without a bunch of wires hanging everywhere. That's annoying to be honest. It has up to 40 hours of writing time. That I think is a little bit of a negative that it has a certain time that you can use the stylus now i don't think i know anybody that uses a stylus for over 40 hours so it's great that they put such a long lasting time on the stylus so you can use it 
for however long you want. And if I'm right, I have not owned the note that has the stylus yet. But if you take the stylus out of the phone, I'm pretty sure that runs the phone's battery down. So with this accessory stylus that is not coming with the phone, it will not run down the phone battery as fast as if you had the stylus that came with the phone, if you know what I mean by that. As a 30-day backup time, that I'm not 100% sure. Again, they got to go a little bit more deal on this 30-day backup time. Auto shut off after 30 minutes. So that's really great. If you're not using it after 30 minutes, it shuts itself off so it conserves all that battery. Polished brass pin. Head for smooth, accurate, and fast writing. So that's where the screen protector design comes in. The tip is really smooth, and it's really nice for phones. And you can also use it on tablets, I believe laptops, and anything that's touch screen, I'm pretty sure you can use the stylus on. As an elegant design for daily use, which again, that's what I first complimented, was this design. I love the design of it, and I really cannot wait to hold it and use it on my phone and see what it's really about. And it's an active capacitor stylus. <clears throat> so this, this is... This is amazing. I never thought they'd come out with something like this. So, let's go back up here. And I commented on something. Oh, I commented on this, actually. And it's this 4-in-1 USB. So, now you don't have to hold this little USB that's only compatible with your laptop. Now, Samsung recently came out with a device that comes with their phones that... Is compatible with USBs. You can even plug mouses into your phone now to use a mouse. Why you'd want to do that? I'm not a hundred percent sure why. But yeah, it's USB-C and Lightning, and I think it has a micro too. I don't know why they didn't put the micro up here in this list, but I'm pretty sure they put it down here in the other list. Yeah, they have micro USB down here. So this. Multifunctional 4-in-1 USB. The Examine Preserve is what they're calling this. They're compatible with most popular Windows, Mac, iOS, or Android devices. So this worked with multi-devices. That's amazing that he made it compatible with all these devices. And different softwares. So, like I said, this is going to be able to handle iOS videos... And send those iOS videos to an Android. To Android videos to send to iOS. Or iOS videos to Windows. Stuff like that. So it's going to be able to convert all these files over to what you need them to to the next device. It has up to 128 gigabytes of storage. That's, that's really great. I love that. That's a lot of storage. I myself usually do not transfer up to 128 gigabytes of storage. Or if you need to, again, it's USB, so if you need to carry it around, then you have it. Or let's say, like, a friend has something on his phone and he doesn't have his phone on him, so you give him this USB and, like, hey, put it on this USB and give it back to me tomorrow and we. I'll see what you wanted me to see, I guess. He does that. Let's say he has an Apple. He puts it on there. Next day, he gives you the USB back. You plug in your phone, and now you have access to whatever he put onto that USB. And the USB isn't just computer computer compatible. So that's really amazing. So all the charging devices it has on it is the USB-C connector, lightning connector, which is the Apple one with the examine part. That's the Apple charger. As a micro USB connector and a USB-A connector. Again, I have no clue what a USB-A connector is. I've never seen one. I've never honestly heard of one. So that, this and the stylus, hands down are going to be my favorite part of this when I get it. But I can't wait to get it because then I get to 
actually like touch these things and like get to know what this company is really about and see what they are promoting here. So this has um So this is just going over a little bit more about the device about um custom operating systems improve performance of a slow or dead desktop. Um, instantly back up all your photos and videos with one click and need a device safe. So I believe this this company is gonna come out with a um a better website for this device. To where you can back up things on this device's website or this company's website and keep it secure. So not only are they going to supply you with this great device, they're going to supply you with a software to go with this device to be able to track it, to be able to save data, to save really anything you want with this four-way USB connector. So... Honestly, I'm I'm kind of speechless. I honestly cannot say much more about this device until I am able to get it into person and I am able to test it out and show you guys what great of a device this really is. It looks sturdy. It looks sleek. It looks really, really clean. I believe that's what this guy was going for was a very, very clean style. And I... I have to say he mastered it. So that is going to be my review on the Examen website. Hopefully here the lady said late October I should be getting my device if I am able to get it. And I will be bringing a video about it then. So I hope everybody loved this video and everybody have a great day.